Go ahead, Dookie Poop. All right, folks, we're back with another talk. <laughs> Santa apparently is getting a little tired right now, so he's a little grumpy. I guess we got to get him another cup of cocoa here soon. Cocoa. Uh, but right now we are back with Oliver and his fantastic foster, Beth. Thank you for joining our team, Thank Beth, you. as a foster. I believe this is your first dog, yes, right? Yeah. Because I haven't met you yet, so I'm assuming. <laughs> um, so we recently saved Oliver. He's a very scared little dog. Uh, but very sweet at the same time, not aggressive with his scaredness, just timid. Uh, but Beth, as her, his foster, can tell us a little bit more. So Yeah, he warms up pretty quickly and just is like a little love. He just wants to be as close as possible to his owner or whoever. Usually me and my... I have a six-year-old son, so he's okay, warmed so he's up good to with my kids. son. Yes. That's great. Okay. It took him a little longer because Ryder was smaller, but yeah, no, he loves him now. And, um, Do you have any other animals? We have no other animals. Okay. He's the only one, but I, he seems very interested in other dogs. Yeah, we 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 introduced him to another dog before, and he was good with it. Yeah. So he's fine with other dogs. Um, we cat tested him as well, actually. I remember that. So he's good with cats as well. Um, how's he doing with potty training in the house? He is pretty good. Okay. It's he's just learning. When, he's learning. <laughs> it's just when we leave. Okay. Actually. So he, you're so leaving him out when you're when you're no, gone. No, in the okay. crate. In yeah, the yeah, crate, okay. and he's still going in the crate. Yeah. A little, okay. Yeah. So we'll talk to you. On yeah, we, we and we can help you with that a little bit. <laughs> yeah. um, as one of our fosters, we try to help them with these training things. Yeah. We'll also help the adopters and give you guys tips as well. Yeah. Um, walks pretty well on a leash, from what I remember. Yeah, pretty well. Yeah. yeah. And um, yes. And then is he sleeping in his crate at night as well? He sleeps in our bed. In your bed? Okay. So <laughs> he sleeps in his bed. No. Okay. So, okay. So, so he really he's sleeping with you, yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, he just likes us. Yeah, and some <laughs> some of the pottying in the kennels when people were gone could be a little bit of just, you know. Anxiety? Uh, not anxiety, but like spite. Like, I'm mad that you left. Mm. I'm going to do this. Mm. But we got to correct that. We got to fix that. Mm -hmm. um, and there's ways to do that. But they will also learn, especially if it's being in their kennel. They're, they're more to pick up on it faster. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so, Santa, if somebody wanted to adopt Oliver, what could they do? If you want to adopt Oliver or any of the dogs or cats <laughs> at the Little Red Dog you can go to thelittlereddog.org, fill out an adoption application, and one of our senior staff will contact you shortly. And that is the first steps. And then you can set up meet and greets and learn all about the dog. And what we'll do also is if, you, if you're interested in Oliver and we find out, you know what, maybe Oliver's not the right dog for you, we can also help you find a dog that we have in the program that we know might fit you better. So thank you so much for everything yeah. you've been doing, Beth. We really appreciate you and your family. Uh, taking Oliver in your home and uh, giving him a nice place to stay while he looks for his forever oh, oh, home <laughs> for the holidays. He's the sweetest. 